questions. Okay. Coming off a uh, big performance, stuff, but uh, going out there each and every time, is your confidence back in the Yeah, uh, the last four or five games, I haven't shooting the ball like I normally be able to, and it, it, it was nice uh, this last game to just see, see a couple go in, and once I get one going in, the second one's it's easier and easier. So I think it was a good confidence builder eh, for, for early in the Valley season, and hopefully I can build on it. Indiana State has a much different look this year. They do return one guy. It's pretty good to talk about him and, and what you know about him. Uh, Jake Odom is uh, he's one of the better players in the Valley. He's a great guard. Uh, he really helps his teammates get better. Um, we have, uh, we, he, was, he was hurt a little bit last year, but uh, he's, he's back healthy this year. We know, uh, we know uh, the key stuff in the United States is not for him. They got off to a slow start, but they've reeled off uh, some pretty good ones here of late. Why, what do they do well? They, they, they really control the pace of the game. Uh, they make you play their, their style of basketball. They don't want you to play yours. And, uh, they, they, um, they have had some guys at least have been hit some shots lately. And, uh, they, they have some shooters too, so we need them. How important is it for you guys? Obviously, every game is important, but getting off to a 3 0 start in conference, is, that would be a nice yes. it, it, It's always big, especially when you're playing home court in the Valley. Uh, it, it's, tough to, it's tough to go and get road wins. Here, so when, you, when you're at home, you really got to take care of business. Do you guys see, a, see any kind of adjustments going into the Indiana State game, or are you just going to kind of keep things consistent, play your game? Um, I, I, I want to see today uh, what kind of sets we got and uh, what kind of game plan the coaches have come up, come up with the last uh, the last two days. But uh, we're still going to go and try to play our game, and we're, we're not going to let them dictate how uh, how we do things, especially offensively. So we'll be ready for them. I think you had about two off the bird's beak on Wednesday. Is there anywhere on the court you're not confident shooting right now? Uh, it, it, when I'm trailing, especially, I don't really look to where I am. It's kind of where the, where the ball gets, and I just let it go up. But uh, I don't really... No, I, I, I don't think there's anything that's too far, especially if I'm in rhythm, that, I, that I'm not going to shoot. And you kind of mentioned the confidence that coach has you in shooting the ball. How much does that play into your... That, that helps a lot, especially because if you're worried about missing a shot and looking over at the bench, see if you're going to get pulled. Um, I, we don't have that kind of thing going on, so uh, it, it, it's always good to know that uh, you coach a supreme confidence when you're shooting the ball. Does that, always, does that feel good to know that if you are in a slump like you like you were before, knowing that he's going to stick with you? Yeah, it does. I mean, I mean the first play of the game that we called was one of our sets for me. And, uh, the first play of the game when I was in it was sets for me, and it, it, it showed confidence with me, and it was, it was, it was a good feeling. You guys are rolling right now, but what, what are some of the things you need to improve on? I thought at times, uh, the last game, we, we kind of got sped up and didn't play our game, we played the Illinois State game, and I think consistent 40 minutes. I think we need to play how, how we talked about playing before and, and really uh, 